Hello, my dear students, my AP students. This year we have the AP Computer Science Principal course, which is one of the AP College Board courses, which of course is related to IT. And uh, today I'm going to introduce this course. My name is Lina Abdullah. I'm going to teach you this course uh, in this academic year where I wish we will do great as usual and we will make sure to cover everything and we will get ready for our external exam. In this video I'm going to introduce this course where what is the AP Computer Science Principle. AP Computer Science Principle is an introductory college level computing course that introduces students to the breadth of the field of computer science. As you know, my dear students, all the AP courses are level, uh, college level courses, which are the, uh, let's say, these courses are going to help you getting ready for your college, which you are very close to it. The students learn to design and evaluate solutions and to apply computer science to solve problems through the development of uh, algorithms uh, and uh, programs, of course. They incorporate uh, knowledge, uh, sorry, abstraction into programs and use data to discover new knowledge. Students also explain how computing innovations and computing systems including the internet work, explore their potential impact and contribute to a computing culture that is collaborative and ethical. My dear student, this course will, uh, let's say, give you a general uh, idea about computer in society, uh, using computer, internet, network, the binary system, and more. I will try now to give you a general idea how we are going to go over all of these details. In this course, we have five different big ideas which we will work under their umbrella. Um, as you know, with College Board, always we have a big idea, and under this big idea, we have certain topics we need to cover. Uh, we have the big idea, one which is creative development, and you will see the weight of this unit in the exam, and later on we'll talk about this in details, where with the creative uh, development we'll go over the collaboration, program functions and purpose, program design and development, identify and correcting errors. Within this big idea, let's say, we will go over uh, details related to technology, computer, internet, mobiles, devices, how they program the designs, how they development, and you know, I'm sure you know that in the computer now, it's an important part of our life. Let's say the technology, I'll not say computer. Now technology where, where it's, in, uh, it's include um, uh, computer, mobiles, uh, portable devices, internet, network, uh, too many things comes under uh, the technology. Also with our second big idea, which is data, we will talk in details about the binary number, the data compression, extracting information from data using programs and data where we'll go over the binary system zeros and ones uh, when we try to uh, compress files what will happen how we can extract this data again what the problem uh, we can have because of that and more we have big idea three which has the maximum load uh, let's say the maximum weight in this course which called algorithms and programming and uh, this big idea had the, the biggest uh, weight because there is a performance task will be implement on this uh, big idea and you as a students you have to submit your performing uh, performance task 
to be assessed within the college board and the result of this performance task will be 30% of your exam and we'll explain this later on. Within this unit you will find different topics about coding, algorithms, uh, mathematical expression, uh, Boolean expression, conditionals, loop, if statement, binary search, and uh, some of you has the chance to do that or to implement that using uh, Python uh, and other languages. Of course, we'll go over that in details and it will represent uh, a big weight of our, let's say, uh, our exam result and even our time we will spend it on this big idea which is algorithms and programming. Also, we have another two big ideas which they are computer systems and network and impact of computing. Of course, they have also weight and, um, for each big idea there. With computer system and networks, we will go over the internet um, and different topics related to impact of computing, of course, using uh, computers and technology has different, uh, let's say, uh, or has more than one side, we'll need to go over that. And I wish this was like a, a quick introduction for our big ideas where we will cover the following topics. Uh, now let's talk a little bit about the exam format because I think this is something very important for you guys. In the exam format, we have two sections. The first section will be multiple choice question MCQ, and it will uh, you will get 70 questions in this section, and the weight of this section is 70 percent, and the duration for it will be two hours, 120 minutes, and you will see that even with the multiple choice questions, you have uh, three different ways of the questions: single uh, select, which is 57 questions. Single select with reading a passage about computing innovation. It will be five questions about that. And multi-select will be eight questions. What do you mean by multi-select? When you have more than one answer for the same question. The second section of the exam, which is called create performance task, will go over it in details, which will represent 30% of the exam. And as they mentioned, at least 12 hours of class, actually we will need more than this. So this is how the exam format will be uh, within your external one. Uh, also here you'll find more details about each big idea and the weight of it, where you find big idea one has 10 to 13%, big idea two has 17 to 22 the uh, the highest weight will be for big idea three which is algorithms and programming also you have big idea for computer system and networking and the last unit or they say the last big idea will be impact of computing my dear students uh, here in the modern american system of course we have our it uh, assessment policy and the grading outline I'll just go over it quickly. As you know, you ha have quizzes, exams, progress check assignment, coding task, and participation. All of that will be included in your assessment. Also, here is uh, the uh, weight for the high school external uh, exam for first and second semester. By the way, they are both the same. You have 15 uh, uh, mark for exams, five for quizzes, assignment 10% participation 5 the total will be out of 35 you have 35 for a1 you have another 35 for a2 and for e1 it will be 30% the total is 100 we have the same situation with the second semester and all in all you get 100 in the first 100 in the second they will be added and divided by 2 to get your final grade which is very important for your high school equivalency for the college, for your GPA, and so on. Our expectation, of course, as all the IIT other classes, you have to be in time, no mobiles, you should listen to your teacher, and so on. 
My dear students, I wish you good luck in this course. Thank you for being 